So this is what I'm going to do today. I'm just going to take a walk around my house, make random sounds with stuff around my house, and then I'm going to make a song out of it. So let's start. I'm going to be recording this with my cell phone, Nokia N900. You can do this with any camera or voice recorder. Here we go. use the piano a little bit. So now let's take those uh, sounds, put them in through our Linux editors, and create music in less than 10 minutes because a YouTube video can't be more than 10 minutes. Okay, so I've recorded that with my camera, and then I uh, logged on to my camera through the wireless network using SSH, uh, but you get you know, whatever phone or camera or voice recorder you have, however you get it. I have the file right here. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to open up the terminal. And uh, what I'm going to use is the same thing I did in the previous video to convert that video to a WAV file. So I'm using mPlayer. And then I use the VO switch to null because we don't want any video. So VO is video out. Then we use AO, audio out, PCM, which is a WAV format. File, we're going to call it sounds, and then we'll put in the name of the video. So I'm just doing that to convert the video that I have to just a WAV file. So I've already done that. It should only take a, a minute or so. Um, then I'm going to open up a program called Resound. That's Resound with a Z, not an S. And it's great for doing little uh, cutting out uh, audio clips and loops, uh, but if you have another uh, wave editor you prefer, go ahead and use that. I will open up the waves uh, sounds wave that I've created, and I will zoom in here. And basically, I'll just take, you know, I'll highlight uh, a section here. I'll play out just that selection, which is me hitting the glass there. I'll then go to save selection as. So it's going to save only what I have highlighted there. And I'd call it something like glass1.wave. Now make sure you put the dot .wave there, because I found if you don't do that, it saves a blank file So for with resound. So I have now created a wave file of that. It'll ask you a few questions. Just click OK. And just go through and cut out any sound that you think you might want to use as an instrument. Then we're going to go into LMMS. We're going to import those sounds and make ourselves a little beat loop to use for a song. And this is all just for fun. I'm going to remove the default sound there. I'll click on this little folder here, which will bring me to my home folder. I've already trimmed all the sounds out of that file that I wanted and put them in a folder under My Music Sounds. And then you can click them to hear them. Double click them will add them over here to our uh, little beat editor and I'll just grab uh, let's see so I've done that now I've got all my instruments over here let's start creating a little loop so I'm just gonna press play up here and start drawing in stuff So we got a little loop going here. 
sound pretty good. I'm going to clone this track. Start like mutant stuff to hear different little loops you created. is I'll just save uh, you know this beat and I'll edit it and make a full song out of it and I will post it uh, in this video. So just a little fun thing you can do with just random things around your house and some open source editors. I hope you enjoyed this video and visit filmsbychris.com for more videos and tutorials on sound editing, video editing, and music creation in Linux.